obtain the thevenin equivalent seen at terminals a b of the circuit in figure we have to find the thevenin equivalent at terminal a b solution to find thevenin equivalent we need rth and vth so first of all we will find rth so to find rth here we can see that there is no independent source so we will consider a 1 volt voltage source this will be positive this will be negative this is 1 volt now let's say this is current io now rth will be equal to 1 by 1 by io now to find rth we have to find the value of io so io let's assume this is uh, node v1 and this is reference node with zero voltage now here we will use nodal analysis to find the value of this io let's say this is current this is current i1 now apply kcl at node v1 so at node v1 if we apply kcl summation of all the entering current entering current is i1 plus io so i1 plus io is equal to leaving current is ix ix now this i1 is equal to 10 ix minus v1 by 4 10 ix minus v1 by 4 plus io now this io is equal to this io is equal to 1 minus v1 by 1 1 minus v1 by 1 is equal to ix now this ix is equal to ix is equal to v1 minus 0 by 2 v1 minus 0 by 2 here also this ix will be replaced so this will be 10 by 4 in place of ix we will write v1 minus 0 by 2 v1 minus 0 by 2 and this will be minus v1 by 4 plus 1 by 1 so this will be 1 directly then minus v1 then this will be minus v1 by 2 is equal to 0 now if we simplify this so this will be 10 by 4 10 by 4 into 2 minus 1 by 4 then minus 1 minus 1 by 2 so this is minus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 v1 then plus 1 is equal to 0 so from this 1 by 2 v1 is equal to 1 therefore v1 is equal to 2 2 volt we have to find the value of io so io will be equal to 1 minus v1 by 1 io is equal to 1 minus v1 by 1 so this will be 1 minus 2 by 1 so this will be minus 1 ampere therefore rth will be equal to 1 by io rth is equal to 1 by io so this will be 1 by minus 1 therefore rth is equal to minus 1 ohm rth is equal to minus 1 ohm next we have to find vth to get the thevenin equivalent circuit we have to find to find vth so here we can see that there is no independent source so therefore vth will be equal to 0 volt now thevenin equivalent will be rth in series with vth so this will be rth and this will be vth this is rth and this is vth rth is equal to minus 1 ohm 
and VTH is equal to zero volt. What we have to find? We have to find Thevenin equivalent at terminal A and B. So this is the Thevenin equivalent at terminal A and B. 